bottom right corner of this text frame, I have the dreaded overset symbol. There is text somewhere in cyberspace, in, in the twilight zone, that is not appearing on the page. There is text that will never print, and that's kind of scary. That little red plus sign frightens me, and I have to know what's in there. What is overset? How much text? Is it a word or two or maybe even a line that I could fairly easily pull back up into this text frame by maybe working on the paragraph vertical spacing or the letting or a slight change to the character horizontal scale? Or is it multiple lines of text that all of those changes will have no effect on? How do I know? I want to know. And I can't. I mean, I could obviously click the plus sign and create a new frame to see what it is, but I shouldn't have to do that. I could also increase the size of this frame until everything pulls in, hopefully, and with a small amount of text, it'll do that. But if it's pages worth of text, nothing's going to happen. So we need to know exactly what text is overset without klutzing around making new text frames or enlarging the frame. Go to the edit menu and scroll down to edit in story editor, which you can also open by hitting control Y on windows or command Y on Mac. Up will pop this floating story editor window. This is the text of your story without accurate line breaks, simply the text of your story. And it will show you what's overset. This black line delineates visible text from what is overset. And then every full line that is overset gets a vertical red rule beside it to let you know. So now I can tell this is a couple of lines of text. This is more than just trying to fit an extra word or two. So I can choose what to do. I can adjust the layout. I can send it back to editorial and say, we need to trim some space off of this. Or I can go to the production manager and say, I need more space for this story. Can we change the ad layout? Can we move this other sidebar story around? Whatever you need to do. This way, you can see exactly what text is overset and choose how to fix it from there. 